Train your mind into thinking that you can turn your weakest points into your advantage. And that entails a lot of strategy. A path to genuine confidence, conviction, and consistency. I am Araya Florence Zara P. Cruz, licensed Philippine stockbroker, institutional sales, sales trader, dealer, and head technical strategies for financial markets. And I will be delivering an exclusive talk entitled, Great Philosophical Executions, The Art of War and the Prince in 21st Century Finance. When people think of me, especially when they look at me or when they realize that I am a stockbroker, of course, they're gonna be surprised me now because I know that I don't look like one. Little do people know that the pains, losses, and struggles that I have endured in my existence will, fortunately, never be experienced by most of you in your entire lifetime. A series of misfortunes that I would not even wish to those who pain me the most. I also graduated with a non-business degree, which is political science, and now currently wading through the waters of a male-dominated industry with high barriers to entry. But all those never stopped me from fighting for a dream that I never knew I was secretly aiming for in my entire life. It just left me craving for more, to win the battles one at a time, until such time that I will be able to tell myself that I have won the war, but not yet. Because everything is a constant process of innovation and self-reinvention, especially in the financial markets. The original question was how I managed to get where I am now. The rise from the ashes brought about by being in the zero. But I think the better question would be, with what mindset? Train your mind into thinking that you can turn your weakest points into your advantage. And that entails a lot of strategy. A path to genuine confidence, conviction, and consistency. I always made sure that I am the smartest, hardest working person in the room. Even if I was already doing technicals in my big teams, and doing so for about a decade now, and already trading in the international markets. When I started trading in the Philippine stock market, I humbled myself and accepted the fact that I was Jon Snow, girl version. I knew nothing. These things allowed me to be picked by my mentor, and at that time, I did not know who he was, and apparently he is one of the best in the industry. He's old but golden, and I consider him to be my second father. Kidding aside, without his guidance, I'd just be another lost soul in the stock market. Three things. First, at the level of the mind. Always evolve. Allow yourself to be positively influenced by the generals of the game. By the people who have been playing the game for so long that they are mostly familiar with the nooks and crannies of it all. Find a mentor that will genuinely guide you out of the kindness of his heart or her heart and not out of profit. Read, read, and read. Familiarize yourself with the terrain, walk the talk, execute the plans in your head wisely. Lose and remember the feeling so that you would not want to experience that feeling ever again. Hold yourself to a higher standard at every passing moment. Second, at the level of the heart. Surround yourself with people who support, believe, and love you. I am fortunate that my family, my friends, and the love of my life are my avid supporters. Third, at the level of your hand, the one which initiates action. In whatever you do, always remember that every action has an equal and opposite reaction. That when it rains, it pours. When it shines, it shines so bright. But never forget all those people who helped you along the way and paid forward to the downtrodden and less fortunate. Let your enemies, aka fellow market players, fear you for what you can accomplish. But let yourself be loved by the people who respect you for the kindness that you do. Mine will be a two-part talk. Great philosophical executions, the art of war and the prince in 21st century finance. First, the art of war, which is about the terrain, aka the market, and the effective philosophical and realistic strategies in playing the game. Second, The Prince, which talks about the people, personalities, groups, and even institutions that you will meet along the way and how they wield tools of greatness and or deception in the game of stock trading. Join me this coming June 27, 2020 at the Investa Online Summit. Don't forget to use my code 
Summit Mariah 10 for a 10% discount on your ticket purchase. Are you ready? See you there!